2022학년도 대학 수학능력시험 EBS 모의평가 영어 영역 제1회 1번부터 17번까지는 듣고 답하는 문제입니다. 1번부터 15번까지는 한 번만 들려주고 16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 방송을 잘 듣고 답을 하시기 바랍니다. 1번 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello viewers. Thank you for clicking on this video. I'm Eric Donaldson from Green Children's Hospital. I receive a lot of questions about donating gifts to our child patients. Since our first priority is to keep the patient safe, we only accept certain kinds of gifts in certain states. First, we accept toys, but they must be new in the unopened original box. We don't accept anything that's been used or opened. Second, we don't accept food, including candy and cookies. To see more detailed guidelines and also our wish lists, please visit our website at www.greenchildrenshospital.org. Thank you very much. 2번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What are you doing, Ethan? I'm making a summer reading list, Mom. Do you want to see it? Sure. They're all contemporary books. Don't you want to read any classics? Well, I'm not sure. Why read something that's so old when I could read something modern that I can relate to more? There are a lot of reasons. Most of all, it can help you improve your vocabulary. Yeah, classic literature does have a lot of useful words. Right. Classic authors used a variety of vivid and unique words to describe situations and characters. For sure. I learned so many new words when I read Charles Dickens' Great Expectations. And it's quite possible that you haven't encountered many of those words in contemporary books. That's true. And it's good to see unfamiliar words in context, rather than just memorizing word lists. Absolutely. Reading classic literature definitely helps improve your vocabulary. Right. I'll add a couple of classics to my reading list. 3번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Thank you for coming, Miss Watson. I'm David Brown. Nice to meet you, Mr. Brown. Please, have a seat. I'm such a big fan of your blog. Thank you. I was actually quite surprised when I heard you wanted to publish my stories. We found the stories on your blog fascinating, And the stories about your students and fellow teachers were especially touching. I'm glad you liked them. As a teacher, I get to meet so many wonderful people. I like to keep a record of them by writing about them on my blog. That's why I'd love to turn your stories into a book. Readers can meet those wonderful people, too. It'd be such an honor. Great. So here's the contract. Please read it over and let me know if you have any questions. And would you like some green tea? Sure, thank you. I'll be right back. 4번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Mr. Jackson, I heard you remodeled the art room. How did it go? Pretty well. Actually, I have a picture of what it looks like. Do you want to see it? Sure. I like this pencil-shaped drawing on the wall under the clock. 
It's really creative. I wanted to add some fun things to the art room, so I also hung this paintbrush from the ceiling. That's really cool. This polka dot tablecloth on the table is a nice addition too. I thought the students would like it. I'm sure they'll have a lot of fun drawing and painting at the table. See these two stools next to the table. I put three there at first, but I removed one because I didn't want the room to be too crowded. Good idea. What are you going to store in this cabinet with a door open? Just basic art supplies such as paint and colored pencils. The room looks great. Oban. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자를 위해 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Mr. Thompson. Where are you headed? The meeting room. A person is here to give a demonstration on how to use the new electronic board. Really? I'd like to see that and learn how to use it, but I'm busy trying to finish up my monthly report. You can't finish it later? No, I can't. I told our department head that I'd show him the report this afternoon. Do you know if there's going to be another demonstration for the electronic board? I don't think so. That's too bad. If I'd known, I would have told the department head I wanted to attend the demonstration. Oh, I heard we could record the demonstration if we wanted to. Really? Can you do that for me so I can watch it later? Sure, I'd be happy to do that for you. Thanks, that'd be really helpful. Six. Hear the conversation and choose the amount of money. What are you doing on the computer, honey? I'm looking for a photo album to put our family photos in. That's a wonderful idea. Digital photos are nice, but having printed photos in a physical album would be really nice. Yeah, look, this one is only ten dollars. Let's order two of them. Okay. By the way, I really like the photo we took in the garden yesterday. What do you say to having it printed and framed? We can put it on the shelf in the living room. Great idea. Let me see how much framed prints are. A four by six frame print is twenty-five dollars. It's not bad. Let's order one. All right. Oh, look at this. We can get the photo printed on a mug. That'd be fun. Yeah, I could bring the mug to my office. How much is it? It's fifteen dollars a mug. Let's get two. One for me and one for you. Great. Oh, look at the banner at the top. You get a five dollar discount when you make an account. Perfect. I'll make one. Yep. It shows the discounted price. I'll pay with my credit card. Sounds good. 7번대화를듣고남자가상담을연기하려는이유를고르시오 Miss Clark, do you have a minute? Yes. Is there something wrong, Daniel? Um, after school today, we're supposed to meet and discuss my final exam results. But can we change it to tomorrow? Let me check my schedule to see if I'm free. Why can't you meet today? Are you feeling sick? I'm feeling okay. It's just I have something to do this afternoon that suddenly came up. It's not related to after-school classes, right? Right. It's because of my school club. I'm in the volunteering club, and today we're going to a nursing home to volunteer. Oh, I see.
The club members just decided to do it yesterday. Okay, let's see. I'm actually not available tomorrow because I have a family event. How about the day after tomorrow? That works for me. Thanks. No problem. I'll see you then. Pybon. 대화를 듣고 2021 리틀 머메이드 발레 퍼포먼스에 관해 언급되지 않은 것을 고르시오. Honey, would you like to go to a ballet performance this weekend? Tickets for the 2021 Little Mermaid Ballet performance are available now. I'd love to. Is that by the Green City Ballet Company? Earlier this year, they hired Steve Johnson as their new director. Yes. And he's directing this performance. Sounds great. When is the performance? This Friday at 6 p.m. Perfect. We can also take Jenny there. The story is the same as Anderson's classic tale, right? Yes. It's about a mermaid princess who is willing to give up her life in the sea to gain a human soul. I'm sure Jenny will love it. I think so, too. How much are tickets? The lower balcony seats are $40 a person. That's not bad at all. I agree. Let's have a nice family dinner together after watching the performance. Sounds great. I can't wait. 9번 이노베이션 워크샵 포 키즈에 관한 다음 내용을 듣고 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Hello, listeners. I'm Sarah Huntington from the Central Science Museum. I'm glad to introduce you to our special program, Innovation Workshop for Kids. It's a three-hour workshop designed for preschoolers. In this program, kids will explore innovations that were made through collaboration. First, the participants will watch a video about the Wright Flyer, the world's first airplane. They will learn about how the inventors, Orville and Wilbur Wright, collaborated to build the plane. Then, they will listen to inspiring stories about collaboration. Lastly, they will use an activity kit to make a wood bead necklace which they can take home. Tickets are $20 per participant. Parking is free for museum members and $6 for non-members. Don't miss this opportunity for your little learners to get inspired and expand their knowledge. 10번. 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 여자가 구입할 매트리스를 고르시오. Welcome to Mattress World. Can I help you find anything? Yes, I'm looking for a queen-size mattress. I see. This way, please. This latex mattress is one of our best sellers. It's very durable. Well, I've had a latex mattress before, and I didn't like it. I need a different type. Okay. How much are you planning to spend? I want to spend less than $600. All right. Then how about thickness? I'd like one thicker than 10 inches. Then these two fit what you're looking for. This firm one offers good support for your back. Sounds great. I'll buy the firm one. Good choice. 11번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Diane I noticed you and Ted didn't talk to each other during the club meeting. What's up? 
You know how Ted is always late for meetings, right? Well, I brought it up to him, and now he's angry at me. Oh, really? What did you tell him? Sixty-two. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, do you know where the ground beef is? I don't see it in the fridge. Oh, uh, it went bad, so I threw it out this morning. I can't believe it. You just bought it on your way home from work yesterday. 13번. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What's that you're watching, Ellie? It's a movie directed by Michael Baker, Dad. I'm so into his movies these days. Michael Baker? I don't know why, but his name sounds familiar to me. Is he famous? Not really. He directed a few independent movies, but I think he's a genius. I've seen all of his movies. Wow! It sounds like you really like him. Wait a minute. I think I read somewhere that he's holding a workshop. Seriously? Yes. Let me check my email. I think I saw it in the city newsletter. Oh, I'll be so excited if it's true. Here it is. Yep, he's holding a small workshop at the art center downtown this Saturday. He's going to talk about his philosophy on movies. Oh my gosh, Dad! I really want to go. Okay, I can take you there. Sixty-four. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Susan, I'm thinking of buying a bike. Oh, do you want to get into biking? Not really, just for commuting to work. I drive to work now, but riding a bike would be healthier and cheaper. And better for the environment. Definitely, I'm planning to get a road bike. Hmm. How about getting an electric bike? Well, I hadn't thought about that. Electric bikes feel just like road bikes, but pedaling is easier. You still get a good workout, and they're just as environmentally friendly as conventional bikes. That's cool, but aren't they really expensive? Actually, they've gone down in price in the past few years, so you can get a pretty good one at a reasonable price nowadays. Besides, your commute to work is pretty far. Right. Considering that you have to commute five days a week, that seems like the preferable option. 15번. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 미스터 밀러가 캐런에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Karen is a student in Mr. Miller's writing class. In class, the students are writing an essay on animal rights. The students have written their first draft, and today they are supposed to exchange their drafts with each other and get some feedback on their writing. However, Karen feels uncomfortable sharing her writing with other students. She tells Mr. Miller that she doesn't understand why she should show her writing to her classmates. Mr. Miller thinks getting comments from classmates will help her revise her essay. So he wants to tell Karen that getting opinions from her classmates will help make her writing better. In this situation, what would Mr. Miller most likely say to Karen?
16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 16번과 17번. 다음을 듣고 물음에 답하시오. Hello viewers. Thanks for visiting my online video channel. In my last video, I talked about how people are suffering from workplace stress. But there's a unique way to reduce it by using specific colors in the workplace. Today, we'll talk about this. Firstly, the color lavender can have a soothing effect. It's the color of the actual lavender plant, which is also known to be relaxing. Secondly, olive green is associated with the environment and harmony, so they can have a calming effect on people. Thirdly, although many offices have white walls, Choosing white-gray, a few shades darker than white, can warm up the walls and make people feel more comfortable. Finally, dusty pink can add a relaxing feel to any space. It's the color often associated with love and friendship. So if you're trying to improve your workplace environment to make it stress-free, try these colors. 다시 한번 듣겠습니다. Hello, viewers. Thanks for visiting my online video channel. In my last video, I talked about how people are suffering from workplace stress. But there's a unique way to reduce it by using specific colors in the workplace. Today, we'll talk about this. Firstly, the color lavender can have a soothing effect. It's the color of the actual lavender plant, which is also known to be relaxing. Secondly, olive green is associated with the environment and harmony, so they can have a calming effect on people. Thirdly, although many offices have white walls, choosing white gray, a few shades darker than white, can warm up the walls and make people feel more comfortable. Finally, dusty pink can add a relaxing feel to any space. It's the color often associated with love and friendship. So if you're trying to improve your workplace environment to make it stress-free, try these colors. 16번 남자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은? Sipchilbon. Ongupten Sekari Aningosen. Ije Titki Munjega 